Pues ahí estaba, fue la experiencia que tuvimos con el Mercedes-Benz CLA. Eh, primero, como decíamos, el 250, el modelo básico que empieza en 29.900 dólares. Y por la tarde manejamos el, el CLA 45 AMG y bueno, siendo un producto AMG realmente eh, espectacular. Eh, un motor, como decía Rob Moran, eh, el más potente de cuatro cilindros que se fabrica actualmente en todo el mundo, 355 caballos de fuerza. Y bueno, eh, es una nueva opción, una nueva apuesta, digamos, está en, entrando a un territorio prácticamente desconocido para la Mercedes Benz aquí en Estados Unidos. Y bueno, para explicar un poco más cómo es que van a hacer el marketing, que ya han visto ustedes alguno, algunos de esos comerciales de la Mercedes-Benz del CLA, se vieron en el Super Bowl. Vamos a hablar, hablamos con Bernie Glazer, el, el director de marketing de Mercedes-Benz aquí en Estados Unidos. Así que escuchemos esta entrevista con Bernie allá en Washington, D.C. So, um, Bernie, we finally had, uh, we have the CLA here, finally. We talked a few times over in the past uh, few months. Uh, since uh, you guys announced the, the coming of this, this new car to the U.S., and finally it's here. And a uh, great drive. We, uh, we drove both uh, 250 and the uh, AMG, so congratulations, a great car. So what's the plan for marketing for this car? I mean, now it's our the market, right? Oh, yeah. We started shipping uh, on Friday last week on the 20th of September. And, you know, this is really a, it's, it's a defining moment for Mercedes-Benz. It's a big moment for us because we're opening up the brand with this car. And marketing-wise, if you look back, Javier, We launched that car already back at the Super Bowl with yeah. our first spot. And it was called Soul. And then we went into, into social media and we did a, a, a big program on, on Instagram which called Take the Wheel. And now, if you watch any TV, you see the two launch spots which are out for the CLA right now. So we bring back the Super Bowl spot and we have a second spot which we call Barriers. Yeah. And uh, it's going to be very different not only in, to, in like bringing a, a, a less expensive car, But also, like, you're, like, benchmarking to other cars that are, like, mainstream for that kind of price range. You're, like, Fusion, some of the Toyotas, and Nissans, and stuff like that. So it's a completely new game for you guys in that, in that aspect, too. Yes, the CLA is a new access point to the brand Mercedes-Benz. At price at $29.9, you know, it really opens up the brand of Mercedes-Benz to a new audience. This car is a conquest car for us, and as you said, you pointed out, We're not just attracting luxury buyers like a 1 Series BMW or an A3. We're actually looking into also attracting some higher equipped Ford Fusions or Honda Accords or Nissan Altima or cars like this. Uh, because if you price these cars, you end up at $35,000 yeah. and then our car starts at $29,900. Yeah. And uh, at 20, as you told me before, like we, we spoke uh, with Miami Fashion Show uh, with Mercedes-Benz. This is the true Mercedes-Benz in every sense, right? I mean, it's uh, the technology and all that. And that other everything that Mercedes-Benz developed has allowed you to put that in this car at a lower price. Absolutely right, Javier. We put 127 years of knowledge of Mercedes-Benz into that car. The CLA is a Mercedes-Benz through and through. The DNA of that car is Mercedes-Benz. It's a true Mercedes-Benz. Yeah. So people, I mean, I've been doing the day here in Washington, D.C. We got a lot of thumbs up, a lot of people asking me what is that, when it's coming out and all that. So what's the message for that new consumer? I mean, like... It's one thing to like watch the TV spot, but like from the marketing head of Mercedes-Benz, what's the message for these uh, people who are liking it and like seeing it for the first time? You know, it is about the brand which is on the move. It's about a brand which is modern, a brand which is moving forward. And if you look at the CLA, uh, this is a car. It's super sexy. It is super aggressive, and it has this you got to have it factor, and yeah. that's what we're all about. Well, we're just standing here by the car, and like people by, passing by and stopping and taking pictures, so you did a good job, and like this is a good marketing campaign also. Oh, imagine, I mean, people are just stopping in the track to look at that car, and this is what we get. This car just looks stunning. Excellent. Thank you very much, Bernie, and uh, I'll talk to you soon, because I, I understand you're going to be pretty busy in the next uh, seven years. <laughs> oh, we have a lot of cars coming. As you said, we have 30 new cars in the next seven years, Javier. Well, Thanks for having me on your well, show. We'll talk to you soon. Thank you. Gracias. Pues esta es la campaña del Mercedes-Benz CLA 2014 que como decía Bernie Glazer, el director de mercadeo para Estados Unidos, ya está llegando a los concesionarios y va a ser interesante ver cómo funcionan estas campañas de publicidad, cómo reacciona el, el consumidor a un Mercedes-Benz de bajo precio. Pero para ser completamente honestos, empieza de verdad en 29.900 dólares. Sin embargo, eh, creo que va a ser difícil encontrar un modelo por ese precio porque obviamente empiezan las opciones, empieza quizá los asientos de piel, el equipo de multimedia, eh, ruedas más grandes, eh, algunas uh, opciones, los, el paquete tecnológico, navegación y todo eso. 
ellos Mercedes Benz espera más o menos que el precio tran de transacción promedio sea de entre 33 mil, 35 mil. Se puede llegar, hemos visto un modelo totalmente equipado casi a los 40 mil dólares, sin embargo eso sucede con todos los fabricantes de autos eh, que presentan el precio base de un modelo para hacerlo más atractivo, para llamar la atención y después empiecen a subir. Así que cuando regresemos vamos a hablar de otro modelo nuevo, el Cadillac City es que fuimos a probar hace un par de semanas por allá en eh, Santa Bárbara en California. Esto es Auto 060, yo soy Javier Mota. 